The new sports report is brought to you by Mosher and Sun Construction, Bob's Merchandise on Nevada Avenue, Cash Express and Pond in the Old White Way Shopping Center, Kirk Pierce Construction. Ask about the USDA grant for senior citizens today. Mosher's Amazing Grace, Car Wars and Detail, Cumberland Gap Medical. Ask about our sports physicals and how to make online payments. If it's high school, middle school, Dixie U, youth football, soccer, basketball, elementary school, and more. If it's local, it's on the program. And now, on with the show. You're watching Navy Grand Sports Report! Welcome to the new Sports Report Friday edition. This edition is brought to you by your friends at Kirk Pierce Construction, Cumberland Gap Medical, Bob's Merchandise, Cash Express and Pond, Mosher and Son Construction, and Mosher's Amazing Grace, Car Wash and Detail. 100%. Kirk and his team completely brought my vision to life of my dream kitchen. Oh, Kirk and his team were here the day that he told me that he would be here, the time of day he told me he would be here, and they stayed until it was finished and paid a lot of attention to detail, which was important to me. And that was another satisfied customer of Kirk Pierce Construction. Amanda Brown and Cumberland Gap Medical reminds us your season starts here. Well, all a patient needs to do is come in and sign in on the schedule. And a sports physical doesn't even take 15 minutes. We listen to the heart rate, we listen to the lungs, we make sure that all the joints are working well. And of course, we've got to be sure we've got good vision if we're going to be playing sports. So we do all of that and you're in and out in 15 minutes. Call for an appointment today at 423-201-9799. There's a huge clearance sale going on right now at Cash Express and Pond in the old Whiteway Plaza next to Long John Silver's A&W on Jack's Pearl Pike. Tools, musical instruments, iPhones, cameras, and much, much more all on sale right now at Cash Express and Pond. Wow. Be sure to apply for your prepaid Visa debit card while you're there. You never know what you'll find at Cash Express and Pond in the old White Way Plaza next to Long John Silver's A&W on Jack's Pearl Pike. Stop by and see us today, 423-494-7053. Save those precious memories to a high quality DVD today. Call Honeybee at WLAF right now at 423-437-1437 and let her save those memories you have on VHS tape to a DVD that will last beyond your lifetime for family members to enjoy for years to come. 423-437-1437 Mosier and Son Construction, licensed and insured. No job too big or small for Mosier and Son, and I know you've probably heard that many times, but it's true. They will do the job right the first time, because Jeff is picky, very picky. Just ask his customer, they'll tell you. Call Jeff. Call today before the bad weather hits at 423-494-8133. For any home improvement you may have to have done, call Jeff. Let's catch you up in some high school sports. In summer camps that have happened over the past couple of weeks, Darrell Cox had his basketball camp a couple of weeks ago with 39 boys who learned dribbling, passing, and all the facets of the game from head coach Darrell Cox. They not only got instruction from Coach Cox, but a few of his players as well. Now, speaking of his players, they will be young this year, according to the coach. They will no doubt go through some growing pains as players like Spencer Boshears and others will be some of the go-to guys on this year's squad. But incoming freshmen like Devin Jones, Jonathan Long, Gavin Cox will add much needed scoring to this young team that will grow up together. So good things for Darrell Cox to look forward to and the Cougar fans as well. And remember, you can follow the Cougars on www.1450wlf.com all season long and watch the games with the voice of the Cougars, the one and only Josh Parker. 
On the other side of the mountain, DJ Osborne brought out his 2019 Jellicoe High School Lady Blue Devils this past Saturday in the 2019 Jellicoe High School Lady Blue Devils Play Day. Six teams met at Jellicoe High School this past Saturday for a play day. Maribel Christian, Lynn Camp, Washburn, Rockwood, Wellspring, and Host Jellicoe. Most teams were not ready for midseason. <laughs> I mean, I'm telling you, it was sloppy. As coaches took advantage of the opportunity, though, to put their teams through the drills but didn't expect a whole lot. Now, Jellicoe in their final game of the day looked pretty good against Rockwood as they played great defense. They won, by the way in which they uh, they played great defense which led to easy baskets and right now all coaches are trying to get as many games in as possible to get their teams ready now jellico will only field nine players total that's with freshmen coming in as well they only got one lady blue devils will be led by the likes of candace brandenburg lily ward and clarissa kramer will play the post but i noticed one thing about clarissa She's a great passer, which means if she's doubled up, she's very good at finding her open teammate. So maybe some good things for DJ Osborne and Lady Blue Devils. No word from Mike Reynolds on the boys' side. They do have a few players coming back. Also, Hayden Lou Allen will be a huge addition to their team this year from Elk Valley, where he averaged something like 50 points per game. I forgot, but anyway, he's going to be a huge addition. There's a few more freshmen coming in to join the fun, so it should be a good year for the Blue Devils. Is your home safe? Here are the top five causes of electrical fires in the home. Faulty outlets, appliances, light fixtures, extension cords, space heaters, outdated wiring. When's the last time you had your wiring checked in your home by a professional? One called AM Electrical Services LLC can put your mind at ease. Call them right now at 423-907-4251 or 423-494-4280. Don't wait another day. Call AM Electrical Services, LLC, right now. Look for AM on Facebook. Amanda Brown and Cumberland Gap Medical reminds us your season starts here. Well, all a patient needs to do is come in and sign in on the schedule. And a sports physical doesn't even take 15 minutes. We listen to the heart rate, we listen to the lungs, we make sure that all the joints are working well, and of course we've got to be sure we've got good vision if we're going to be playing sports. So we do all of that and you're in and out in 15 minutes. Call for an appointment today at 423-201-9799. There's a name that is rapidly becoming a name you can trust. Kirk Pierce Construction is becoming a company that shows up on time, finishes the job on time, and just the way you want it. Whatever your home improvement project, call on Kirk Pierce Construction today. Making your vision come true. That's exactly what we do at Kirk Pierce Construction. Call today, 423-912-4280 or 423-907-2439. Mosher's Amazing Grace Car Wash and Detail. We're located just below the courthouse in Jacksboro on the right. Family owned and operated, free pickup and delivery. Open 9 to 5 Monday through Friday, 9 to 12 on Saturday. We will stay longer if needed. Call today 423-494-2594 or 423-912-1600. Whether it's a simple car wash or a complete detailing, call Mosher's Amazing Grace Car Wash and Detail today. Turning to football, Justin Price had his Cougar football camp this past Monday and Tuesday. The numbers were not what Coach Price is accustomed to, but I think the weather had a lot to do with it, and the campers, although they all had a great time. Former Campbell County High School great Zach Rutherford, who now attends University of the Cumberland, spoke to the campers. He spoke about commitment and going through the rigors of coming back from injuries just like he did at Campbell County High School. So he knows a little bit about it and he talked a lot about it. Now we got a chance to speak to him after he spoke, before he left. It was great to see this quiet young man who is well on his way and he will be competing for a starting job on this year's squad up there at the University of Cumberland and we wish him the very best. Now back to the football team. Now we went up there the final day of workouts before dead period 
they're still not saying who will be the signal caller, the quarterback this year. I guess we'll wait and see. But we do know they have implanted some new wrinkles in this year's offense. So it may not be the same look for Justin Price's offense this year. But you know, you can follow every game, every snap, right here on the WLAF and Tire Sports Network with our old buddy Les Martin and Brent Allen. In soccer, Brian Horton has both his boys and girls teams involved in a great summer camp up at Kemper County High School. I love it. Head coach Michael Shaw does the morning session and his assistant Joshua Reed does the afternoon sessions. A little different drills from the morning session to the afternoon session. Ball handling drills are stressed more in the afternoon session as opposed to positioning drills in the morning but overall a camp that focuses on every aspect of the game of soccer and I'm telling you I went up there and I saw what they was doing I love it Amanda Brown and Cumberland Gap Medical reminds us your season starts here well all a patient needs to do is come in and sign in on the schedule and a sports physical doesn't even take 15 minutes we listen to the heart rate, we listen to the lungs, we make sure that all the joints are working well, and of course we've got to be sure we've got good vision if we're going to be playing sports. So we do all of that and you're in and out in 15 minutes. Call for an appointment today at 423-201-9799. From start to finish, J&J Cabinets and Trim complete the job, whether it's in the kitchen, living room, or wherever it may be. Call Joshua at 423-437-1776 or Jason at 423-871-1447 and let them come out and give you a fair and honest estimate of how little the job will cost to beautify your home and improve its value. So, call J&J today. You'll be so glad you did. Buying online versus buying in person. When buying online, you're not sure. You're frustrated and forget about a quick refund. Why go through all that when you can go in, browse and find exactly what you want at Bob's Merchandise on Nevada Avenue. Tell them, William. If you're going to buy an instrument, you want to see how it feels and how it sounds like in your hands or if it's heavy or not and just how much you like it because online you can't see every little bit of it and you can't hear it either. That's Bob's Merchandise, 128 Nevada Avenue. Here in La Follette, 423-566-1031. Tired of your contractor giving you the runaround? Better call Kevin. Call Kevin Ward at Southern Contractors. The only running they do is to get the job done in time and at affordable prices. That's Kevin Ward at Southern Contractors, 423-912-3186. Better call Kevin. New cheer coach at Jacksboro Middle School, Caitlin Ray Souter, a former Jacksboro Middle School and Kemah County High School cheerleader and LMU cheerleader had her summer camp. Now this is her first year coaching. We were invited to go down and take some snappies and they had well over 40 girls come out for camp, which is a good thing. It was a lot of fun. They tumbled, jumped, formed pyramids and even had a water balloon event on the last day of camp where all the campers took aim at all the Jacksboro Middle School cheer coaches, well, the cheer team, and you know these little guys took full advantage of that. It was a lot of fun. No word on the LaFollette Middle School side just yet. We do know that Amy Long is no longer the cheer coach for the girls. We don't know who the new coach is, and we'll leave it right there for the time being. LaFollette Middle School boys coach Ken Dream Weaver had his basketball camp a few weeks back. He had almost 50 boys, maybe more, in the gym learning all the facets of the game of basketball. We don't have any schedules just yet on any of the basketball teams, but once they come out, we'll get them and we'll get them to you and we'll let you know what's going on. What we do know is we'll have a very, they will have a very young squad this year. So Al fans, be patient. Now on the girls side, Craig Ivey will be a much improved team, but still young. Coming off a bad season last year, his team should be much improved. Speaking of track, wait a minute, nobody was speaking of track. But we want to tell you about a young lady from La Follette Middle School. Olivia Marlowe was voted the area's most valuable athlete after making her mark in track and field in middle school. At the area track and field meet, Olivia Marlowe was voted the area's most valuable athlete with individual wins in the long jump, 100 meter hurdles, as well as the 4 by 200 meter relay. She placed 7th, now get this, 7th in the state track meet at Austin P University 
in the 100 meter hurdles, as well as ninth in the long jump. She must have had a bad day. Marla was also the 4x200 meter relay that placed 12th in the state. So pretty good numbers. Now get this, she is also the new LaFollette Middle School record holder in the long jump with a jump of 14 feet 10 inches. Hey, that's pretty good. That's comparable to high school scores. Mosier and Son Construction, licensed and insured. No job too big or small for Mosier and Son, and I know you've probably heard that many times, but it's true, they will do the job right the first time, because Jeff is picky, very picky. Just ask his customers, they'll tell you, call Jeff. Call today before the bad weather hits at 423-494-8133 for any home improvement you may have to have done. Call Jeff. Save those precious memories to a high quality DVD today. Call Honeybee at WLAF right now at 423-437-1437 and let her save those memories you have on VHS tape to a DVD that will last beyond your lifetime for family members to enjoy for years to come. 423-437-1437 Amanda Brown and Cumberland Gap Medical reminds us your season starts here. Well, all a patient needs to do is come in and sign in on the schedule. And a sports physical doesn't even take 15 minutes. We listen to the heart rate, we listen to the lungs, we make sure that all the joints are working well. And of course, we've got to be sure we've got good vision if we're going to be playing sports. So we do all of that and you're in and out in 15 minutes. Call for an appointment today at 423-201-9799. There's a huge clearance sale going on right now at Cash Express and Pond in the old Whiteway Plaza next to Long John Silver's A&W on Jack's Pro Pike. Tools, musical instruments, iPhones, cameras, and much, much more all on sale right now at Cash Express and Pond. Wow. Be sure to apply for your prepaid Visa debit card while you're there. You never know what you'll find at Cash Express and Pond in the old White Way Plaza next to Long John Silver's A&W on Jack's Pearl Pike. Stop by and see us today, 423-494-7053. Our six and under all-stars are making some noise down in Kingston. Or they made some noise over the, the past weekend at Kingston. All three games they have played in, they won them. The one, game one, they beat Rockwood 21 to three, giving up three runs in the first inning, then that was it. They settled down. In game two, they proved that the first game was no fluke. They won over homestanding Kingston, and that's tough. They always have a good team. They won 17 to two. And in the final game of the weekend, for our All-Stars. They beat Oakdale big as well, 20 to five. They played Monday and beat Tri-County, then advanced to win in the championship game. They won District 8 over Kingston in a forfeit of sorts to advance into the state as a number one seed coming out of District 8. Now they will play at Summertown, just south of Nashville, in Pool 4, which will consist of Pleasant View, Summertown, Campbell County, and one more. Our All-Stars will play Thursday morning at 10 a.m versus Pleasant View, and keep in mind, these are all Central Standard Time. So get down there if you can and support our All-Stars. They are coached by Jason Freeman, Josh Campbell, Mike Robbins, Dana Parson, and we spoke with Coach Jason Freeman, who was very proud of his team, and he told us the most important thing he was the proudest of was the Sportsmanship Award his team received. They won second last year, and this year, first. And according to Jason, they hope to at least finish in the top three. This is the third time the six and under team have made it to the states, and if you recall, they used to have to play a sub-district before the districts, and they cut all that out, so now they only have to play the districts, which I think is a good thing. Play the districts, move on to the state. The eight and under team is already eliminated from the tournament. Now the 10 and under, now get this, they will play in Rockwood this coming week, and the 12 and under All-Stars will start this week, yes, at Asbury in Carroll, Tennessee, Asbury Park. So you know old David will be there for these guys and maybe we can get a broad, maybe, just keep your fingers crossed, maybe we can broadcast the championship game if our all-stars are involved in it. I hope they are and I hope I get to broadcast. The game winning goal, what's your first name? Journey. Hey Journey, now what was, what was going through your mind as you was getting ready to kick? Make the goal. 
make the goal. And also kick it to the corner because right. that's where the goalie would least expect it. Alrighty. Now the, the goalie, the winning goalie, come up here, young man. What's your first name? Skyler. Skyler? You played a tough game, buddy. You've done a great job. Now, uh, uh, you guys got to do the same thing in the next round, don't you? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, I wish you guys the best, okay? Okay, thank you. Okay. Trying to get a good angle here. What is your first name? Benjamin. Benjamin. Benjamin, how many girlfriends you got? Six. Okay, that's the wrong question. <laughs> Are you ready to do a sports report promo? Yep. Just repeat after me, okay? You're watching. You're watching. David Grams. David Grams. Sports report. Sports report. You got it, baby. Mike Riley and the Camel County Youth Soccer League had their banquet this past Saturday as the kids enjoyed some pizza along with the chance to win some trophies and competition drills. An all-day event which everyone seemed to enjoy. Now don't forget they'll have their sign up starting Wednesday, July the 3rd at 5.30 at the soccer field behind the Fallout Elementary School. Make a note of that. Okay, that's all the sports I've got for you. Now don't forget we're going to take another break. Uh, during uh, dead period we'll kind of take a break and We'll catch it all up when football starts back up. But anyway, we thank you guys for being with us. We want to invite you to go by and see our sponsors, Kirk Pierce Construction. Ask them about their senior grant program. Cumberland Gap Medical. Did you know they offer sports physicals? Yes, they do. Bob's Merchandise on Nevada Avenue, Cash Express and Pond. Moser and Son Construction and Moser's Amazing Grace Car Wash and Detail. Go by and see these guys and thank them for sponsoring me and helping me do what I do and what I do is promote your babies in athletic competition. Thank you guys for being with us again and we'll see you next time. God bless. Bye bye.